What's going on, y'all? Hope everybody's having a great day. So this is top 16 anime where the main character is overpowered since the beginning and surprises everyone. Okay, I don't know why the main character... Well, we're going to see. We're going to see. It depends what anime we're looking at. Rank number 14. Okay, I don't know a lot of these animes we're going to see. Hopefully one of these surprised me that I know. I don't... I don't know why this beat go hard. I don't... I don't know why I'm on the boulevard. I don't, I don't know why I had to put your card. I don't, I don't know why you looking like Bart. Uh, pull up on the scene, playing like a bard though. Playing at the house, playing on Nintendo. Uh, people looking out the window. I don't mess with guns. I don't do extendos. Oh, but you know I got them bars. Uh, got them bars. Got them flying to Mars. Uh. And we driving to cars. Why is people shocked at rank number one? Hold on, why is, hold on. Why is people shocked? Uh, you know the grind never stop. 911, you can call the cops. I got a rank number two. Rank number two is an anime that I feel like I should have been watched. Like I feel like I should have watched that anime all the way back in high school. But why are people shocked that One Punch Man is is as strong as he is? I'm, I mean, actually, I think people, yeah, actually, people actually were. Now that I changed my mind, people actually were shocked at how One Punch Man was because he wasn't like that, but he got stronger. Oh, it, it only took him like two years to train it. So imagine he keeps even going. He keeps training because it didn't take him three years to get that good, but he keeps training. He's going to be even way more dangerous. Who knows what else, you know, he has in store, like, in the show because I haven't watched the season two